So I have a question for you guys. Does this caricature of me look like Sarah Palin to you? I went to the Renaissance Fair. I actually just got back from it. And I got this caricature of me. And I think it looks... I, I'm, I look like Sarah Palin in this picture. But that's just my opinion. I also think I look like I'm 40 years old in it. But it's still cool. Whatevs. But yes, I just went to the Renaissance era. So much fun. I just got home, actually. I'm currently in my pajamas as I get home. But I'm still in my... Renaissance makeup. I went as a gypsy. It was so much fun. Maybe I can show you guys what my outfit looked like. If I can get my picture off my... I don't know why if I say if. I'll show you a picture of it somewhere on the screen. And you guys can see my outfit. I dressed up as a gypsy. It was awesome. But let's get on to the actual video. Today I have a tag for you guys. I what this is the I don't even know what this tag is called. I'll put it somewhere. I don't I took a picture of the questions, but I forgot to take a picture of the name the tag of the video name of the tag. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm kinda of tired. But I do know that I was tagged by Whitney over at Accio Books and I'm pretty sure it was created by Whitney from Witty Novels. But I'm not completely sure on that one. The first question is, where do you find inspiration for your videos? And honestly, usually it's from watching other people's videos. And just having videos like click like, oh, I could do a video like that. Or something along those lines. But again, usually my videos are from watching other people's videos. Or just reading something or something like that. Number two is, do you have a Word document, notebook, etc. dedicated to video ideas? Yes. This composition notebook right here is dedicated to all my videos and everything like that. Like when I want to write something down. See, there's all of this stuff from all my past videos and everything like that. And something just flew out of there. Oh no. Number three, how do you prep for a video? I put my camera on my camera stand and turn on my light. <laughs> That's how I prep. Usually I am wearing the exact same thing I've been wearing all day at work. Rarely do I make myself up. I just do what I do and then I the only thing I prep with is make sure that my battery is full and put it on the camera stand that's it number four how does it long how long does it take you to prepare your appearance for a video as I just said I usually wearing whatever I wore that day so I don't really prep my my looks so yeah number five what time of day do you film whenever I get the feeling to film. Like right now it is like 8 30, 9 o'clock at night. Sometimes I'll be filming at 10 o'clock in the morning. I film whenever it strikes my fancy. Number six is show tell us where you film and that is right in front of my bookcases inside of my bedroom. I would show you a tour of my bedroom but it is a disaster area. It is so terrible in here. Oh my gosh there's so there's clothes everywhere and it's not even dirty clothes. It's just a buttload of clean clothes everywhere. But yeah, it's my bedroom slash my library area. Number seven is natural lighting or studio lighting. I try and get both if I can. Uh, there's a window right there. So if I'm filming earlier on in the day, I always open my windows to get some natural light. And then I also turn on my artificial light that's actually pretty bright right now. It's actually pretty dim because I need to switch the light bulb out. So it's on like the dimmest setting because it's a three three setting light bulb whatever it is and the higher two burnt out or whatever the case may be but it's kind of dim right now but yes I use both and then I have also have this lighting right here that is actual my room lighting so yeah number eight is what type of camera do you film with and it is a Canon PowerShot ELF 300 HS 12.1 megapixels that is what it says on the front of it and it is red it is a red camera that is what I film with Number nine is, do you ever script your videos slash go off an outline? <laughs> no. <laughs> unless, it's, unless it's a review for a book, I don't go off of a script. I, that's why my videos are always terrible, because I never know what I'm saying. Like, I will have videos of me just, of just dead space, because I don't know what to say, and I forget the words that I want to say, so there's a lot of dead space in my videos and whatnot. Number 10, if you edit your videos, what program do you use? Um, I use the Adobe one, not Photoshop, the other one. Oh crap, it's not Dreamweaver. Premiere Pro? Is that it? I think it's, I think it's Adobe Premiere Pro. If that's not it, then I'll put the name below, but it's, it's like the fifth 5.1 generation or something like that. I'm not completely sure. 
Number 11, how long are your unedited videos before you scale them down? Depends on what it is. If it is a book haul, it can be upwards of 20 minutes because I have to keep leaning down, picking them up, show you guys the books. But if it's something really little, like a uh, Top 5 Wednesday, it'll be less than 5 minutes long. And it just depends on what the type of video it is, how many times I have to lean down. Foxy, you better not start barking. I am filming. Number 12, how many times do you try to film per week? Uh, I've been getting worse with this. It usually ends up to be one time a week. I try and do it twice a week, but it's just I don't have time for it. I wish I did, but it usually ends up being once a week. Because I don't really, I'm not huge on pre-filming. I don't like filming a bunch of things at once because, I don't know, I just don't like doing it. Because then I feel like I have to edit them both at the same time. I just, mm, not my thing. <laughs> Number 13, how often do you pre-film videos? Not often. If I do the top five Wednesdays and I have a lot of them in the month that I want to do, I might pre-film all of those all at once because they're really short videos. But in general, I do not pre-film videos. So that's a thing. Number 14 is how long will a typical video take from setting up your equipment to uploading? If it includes uploading? <laughs> all night. Because <laughs> it will literally take from like 10 at night to like 5 in the morning to upload a video because depending on if somebody's using the internet as well because I don't have the fastest internet in the world <laughs> and filming usually takes like I said depends anywhere from like 5 to 30 minutes usually doesn't take longer than 15 20 minutes 15 minutes being the kind of median between everything and then editing usually about another 15-20 minutes depending on how long the video is so all together maybe 30 minutes to an hour somewhere in that range of getting it to being getting it to being ready to upload I think that made sense and then uploading is just a whole nother story but yes that completes this tag at least I'm pretty sure it did and yes I don't really know who I'm gonna tag because I don't know who's been tagged in here but Let's see, if you've, I'm going to tag whoever has been to a renaissance festival. If you've ever been to a renaissance festival, then I tag you in this video. Tag you in this video for this tag. Yes. If you guys have ever been to the renaissance festival, tell me down below. I would love to hear from you guys and what your experiences have been. If you've ever dressed up, it would be awesome if I could see pictures of you guys dressed up. That'd be so cool. Okay, but yes. That is all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed watching because I sure as hell love talking. I will see you guys next time.